Ah oh man, sometimes things just don't go as you had planned. And that is when you say, life's a beach. I don't know man, Th these level names, they are so silly. <laughs> they were really pushing creativity in this one. <laughs> but uh, I must admit, they are kind of charming. They, they are what makes Croc, Croc, right? Yeah, you, you tell him how happy you are, Croc. You do that. So, you know, they, they do have kind of a charm to it, but uh, really, life's a beach. Really scraping the bottom of the barrel here. Uh, what, what kind of mess are we in here, actually? There's a cage, and there's a door on the other side as well, and there's a golden door. So we need two keys, and we have two doors. I'm just speculating here, but I'm pretty damn sure there's one key in each room. Or not. Because this one doesn't seem to have one. Way to jump straight into the bullet set. I mean, jumping right into a bullet takes skill too, you know. It's not like anyone can just do that. Except me. And that was just walking into it. Walking into a bullet is actually easy. That is, uh, that, that is an easy skill to master. I don't recommend you master that. Because, uh, you know, it it, 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 it it tends to hurt, I've heard. I've never really experienced it myself, luckily. But, but uh, yeah. Walking into a bullet, easy. Avoiding a bullet, now there's something you, uh, you need to train for. Oh, I remember this room. This room sucks because it has those platforms and, uh, well... Let's see if we can actually make it. Wow, well, surprisingly, I actually did. Only for the next one to mess up, no doubt. Nope. Well, there's only one thing to do, and that's say that I actually got this down, and I can do this. And I'm totally awesome, and... Huh, surprisingly, that worked. Normally, that's where you go, uh... No, we're not working now. Uh, let's try the button. What does the button do? It seems to be a time button. Oh, it brings that platform over, okay. Okay, you can climb up here. Let's see if that is also a colored gem. Wow, this one is the hardest to make. But okay, apparently no problem for me. I don't know what I ate uh, this morning, but uh, it sure helps. <laughs> Well, not for my voice, because that totally went there. <laughs> you know, if you were dashing, you know, continue to dash and not stand and laugh, you might have actually had a chance to hit me there. A fairly big chance, actually. But, uh, nope. You were... Whoa, almost missed the boxes here. Nice. Some gems. Not that I'm gonna keep him. Although, you know, seeing how good I'm doing so far, who knows? The platforming is actually working out for me uh, this time around. Oh, why did I do that? I need to jump to the cage. There we go. Let's go through the golden door. Well, well, golden lock door, I suppose. But the door does look a bit more fancy than the normal ones. Oh, great. Another dark section. Anything back there? Nope. Okay. Well, let's move on then. Actually, I might have actually wanted to... Um, what's the word? Think. Go. Didn't know you could actually hang on to these uh, things. But yeah, let it replenish. But luckily, uh, we made it in time. Hello, Mr. Key. I'll take you along. Damn it, it's the wrong key. <laughs> it won't fit. Okay, well, let's uh, head back because we could go two ways there. So let's check out the other way. Wow, that one really fades fast. Okay. 
And here is where the key does fit. So is there a golden key over here? Oh great. These stupid platforms when there's a time limit. Nice. But that's uh, not too bad. Okay. So the golden key must be here. Oh good. More platforming goodness. But there is indeed the golden key. Well, since there's some gems here, might as well pick them up. You know, it's always worth to attempt in the off chance that I do actually manage to get them to the exit. Then uh, we might be in business for some extra life -age. Keeping my fingers crossed on that uh, hope, but you know, if you don't try, you're certain to fail. Am I right or am I right? Doesn't seem to be anything up there, so let's just uh, go through the grating. I can okay, I can actually jump on top of that. You know, I'm kind of pissed about that one. <laughs> that was just mean. I'm surprised he didn't laugh his ass off for that one, because, you know, that was something I would really laugh at. Man, that was just awful. <laughs> for that, you get whacked in the face, my friend. There you go. Yeah, okay, so the, the right way to do that is to go upstairs anyway. Upstairs, well... Okay... Butt stomp that thing and go for the platform. You can actually, um, you don't have to butt stomp if you time the, uh, if you time the, the, the X button correctly, you can actually jump high like so, but it's kind of, well, you need to be good at it, and if you do it with a butt stomp, you're certain to get some air. Which was barely enough, apparently. Oh man. You, my friend, are getting butt stomped. What? How'd he hit me? He was already dead. Oh man. That was totally unfair game. And I do not agree with that hit at all. No! Stupid platform. I hate you. <laughs> Oh. Well, so much for luck. I just had to say it, right? I just had to say everything was going smooth. Doing so well and... It yeah, let's replenish that and go for these nasty platforms. I wouldn't dare do those in the dark. I mean, they're hard enough when you actually see them. Oi! But, oh well. Uh, these didn't have... Uh, no, no gems. Oh well. It was worth to check, you know. Let's see what's back here. Boxes are always nice because they tend to have goodies. And we do want to collect all the goodies. Although gems aren't really priority. But you know, it's, it's always worth to check out. Can we actually jump straight through the... Yep, we can. Okay. Easy enough. Damn it, I should not say that. That's just jinxing myself. Honestly. No, this game is so freaking hard, man. I, I wouldn't know what to do. So hard. Always dying. There we go. That should keep me safe for at least two minutes. <laughs> I hope. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of these stupid platforms now. Well, uh, just hope you enjoyed your 40 lives or so, Croc, because how many do we actually... Yeah, 40. Because...
because uh, this, this just spells disaster. Ooh, almost overshot there. Screw this, I'm jumping off. Oh crap. Where are the platforms then? Back there again? Uh, did I screw myself? Can you actually walk through him? Okay, not, not much of a problem. Oh, and those are actually big platforms. Thank goodness. These are easy to handle. No problem there. Kinda half expected to fall off, but... <laughs> luckily I didn't. No, we have had enough failing for one day, I... ...do say. So let's go uh, for another face-up. Off with Mr. Ghost over here. This one is also fairly easy, honestly. Although, the problem with this part is that you have a bunch of these stupid platforms to contend with. And this is the hardest part of this section. Well, not this, but I mean the uh, small platforms in general. But you should be fairly safe with uh, this um, area, as long as you uh, manage to do the platforming alright. There's no real need to uh, rush it, and you'll soon see why that is. Because this ghost also takes a bit of a detour. Oh man, these jumps are just terrible to make. Because he goes up there, but instead we go to the right. And go over the gong. And look at that, there is the key. Now if you go with the egos, then it's kind of hard. See, these levels aren't too bad. I really like these levels actually. And there is the cage. I really enjoy these ghost chases. I'm not sure why people are complaining about them so much. Because they are fun. And I am kind of sad that they are over. Because next time we will face the next boss. The end boss of the desert stages. And we got an extra life, which is nice. Although we won't really need it with the next boss. Although, I... Sh well, probably not. I would be very humiliated if he killed me. But, uh, anyway, let's check him out tomorrow. And until then, guys, take care, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.